Welcome back to Rockstar Trading Channel, it's Crypto Rocco here back with another video guys and in today's video we'll be talking about top 5 coins to buy this month guys. So I'm doing this video of top 5 coins to buy, I'll try to do it a couple of times a month, I did one this month already, I'm doing an update for this month and potentially August as well. So the first coin I'll talk about is Binance coin guys. Binance coin if you guys have been following me has been one of my most profitable trades I called it one of the best coins of 2019 and from from just percentage point of view Binance coin has been my most profitable trade I got in here as you can see it's been my most profitable trade I think I got out some here and then rest of it here I didn't hold the, the all of it because I didn't know how where it will turn back and the reason for it is I'll give you some of the reasons again you can watch my video on Binance to get all the details but some of the details so this uh, few people have said to talk about fundament fundamentals and also you know incorporate fundamentals and technical analysis so I'm going to do that Binance coin I like it fundamentally as well they they do coin burns which reduces the supply which helps you know if supply re is reduced the demand and it stays the same you know the price is likely to go up so that's one of the reasons the the transaction fees that they charge they make crazy m amounts of money to through transaction fees so that's another reason for them to buy Binance coin they're also adding margin trading which will attract more traders I'm gonna use I use bitmex for uh, for margin trading I'm gonna move to probably Binance more funds they have IEOs which is great again I'm giving you a clue on what another coin I'm gonna talk about so this is a really good coin I put I made this post in in my Facebook group in my Twitter telegram everywhere you can find and I've been posting these you know that my trading strategy is Litecoin and Binance coin and I posted that you know five four days ago you can you could have used that point and the reason for that was guys because litecoin and binance coin actually was the two key coins in this bull run in 2019 that's why i've always been looking at binance coin and litecoin and you can probably guess another coin uh, that's in the top five this video so that's why i'm really interested in binance coin I've, like i said i posted about it in the facebook group again few people say i, I brag too much so i'm not going to go into detail of that but i did talk about it again you can join those groups guys if you're interested so that's the reason and it's pulled back to a really good zone again i just don't trade the fundamentals i, I, I thought it was a bit too extended there i didn't really look to buy it here that's what i said but it's pulled back to around the 50 percent and 618 zone this always seems to be a good zone to look to buy at you know you can see it just touched that level i got in some again if you bought a few when i made that post again i don't like to call it trading signal make sure you use that in my my posts and you know analyze it before you you buy it just don't blindly buy it and it is already gone up i think 10 20 percent from there so it would have been a really nice trade so let's see if it can get above the, this 50 percent zone then it could really rally again at least to the previous high so that could be a really nice trade i'm gonna have a look at binance coin usd D ch chart but I'm mainly using Bitcoin to trade Binance coin again you can see this has pulled to a good zone as well if I pull my Fibonacci up as well that will be around that 618 zone that I like to trade so you know it's it's broken below it then move strongly above so you can see that it's a nice little level to buy at let's see if it can stay above that moving average guys and hold i mean it could come and retest this daily moving average if it can't go up so you might want to wait for that or if you're really interested you can start dollar cost averaging so that's the first coin i'd like to talk about today the second coin i'd like to talk about today is a coin that i said again i've been re i've been traveling lately so i've not been as um um, as as uh, I've not been posting as much on the internet, but this is another coin, guys. Ren, I posted it on on Facebook, Twitter, Telegram, and you can see, guys, I uh, talked about Ren, E R D, and one. And Ren is a coin that has been on fire, guys. So let's have a look at Ren, guys. And not just that, guys. I think Ren was the one of the top five coins that I made the video about yesterday. Hopefully, you just, you guys just don't watch my videos. Actually, you know, try to learn from it. I, I talked about top five coins and. And Ren was definitely in there, and um, I think Ren was just about here again, around that 50%, 61% zone near my moving average. You can see the price action, you can see the volume spike here, guys, and you can see the volume dying down and then spiking again. Great entry. I think if you go watch that video, it was uh, it must have been around there when I uh, when I made that video. It rallied up. I took profit at the white line, and then it came back. 
I saw some when it went below it. When I saw, you know, volume coming in here and that this candlestick on the shorter time frame, it's really visible. You can see it really nicely. I got back in again, and I think that's when it when I got back in here. That's when I made made the post on Facebook. I've got so many media platforms. I get lost with where to post, and I'm you know speaking to someone uh, to help me with kind of my social media coverage, and 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 I'm starting an educational group as well because I can't really do mentoring as much because there's so many people. So Ren is a coin that I'm really interested in and guys again I don't want to give go too crazy on it but if it can stay above this zone the, this white line I've drawn I probably should draw it a little bit lower if it can stay above this zone guys this can rally hard I know it's already rallied a lot but people are looking at it now I talk to you know you shouldn't just jump on things you shouldn't look to buy it here because you know it's already up you know since even I posted it, it's already up 70 I think I closed at 60 percent it's already up as you can see 70 percent almost so you've got to be careful guys you shouldn't buy something that's pumped but if it can stay above this guys and it gives you nicer to price action you know, RSI cools down a bit and goes up you could look to buy it again but at the moment guys it is holding the moving average and it is it would be a nice really nice little trade uh, which I hodled a lot guys I think I sold my rest of it at 960s I think this one yeah, sold around 950, 960s. But yeah, I'm gonna keep an eye on for Ren. If it can stay above it, guys, it could really rally. I was looking at fundamentals as well. They are interesting fundamentals. You know, they're trying to do, you know, a, a kind of a dark exchange. I think they call it. Um, which is you know the crypto OTC market. You know, there's there's issue with trust and verifying. So if they if we can you know have a broker or dealer that we can trust and if they can deliver what they're saying uh, ecosystem that would allow to place trades in a trustless environment then you know that is completely secure that could be a good project but again I don't know too much about fundamentals so you know, I'm, I'm not going to go into too much detail but that is uh, the second coin that I wanted to talk about the third coin I like to talk about is Stellar Lumens guys it's a coin that I actually like the fundamentals I've spoken to a few people on Reddit uh, from, the, from their team it's a coin that they're always working on they've got real world applications again just because I like XLM doesn't mean I hate XRP they're trying to do something similar and there's not just you know one winner there can be a few different winners as well but the reason I want to talk about XLM today is I think I've made videos on XLM is if you look at the XLM chart uh, which one do I want I want I need chart history not this one apologies guys I should have had that chart ready for you let me try Stella Right, this is the one that I want. So, guys, if you, as you can see, guys, it had a crazy pump in 2017, 2018. Since then, this coin has not pumped at all. So that is what makes me think, you know, this coin could pump again. I was really interested in it here, guys, and it broke down. I lost that trade again. At this channel, I'm completely transparent, and if I do make the educational group, I'll be quite transparent with you guys. And as you can see, guys, it broke below that and it couldn't get above the moving averages and it has been on a crazy downfall the weekly monthly RSI everything is super super low and that's what makes me think this could have a bit of a rally I've done a similar trade on TRX again that wasn't as profitable as I would have liked but it did get a nice little pump XLM I'm looking for the same thing you can see the crazy d price action here so if it pulls back slightly lower guys you know this could have at least a nice little pump I'm not saying it will you know break to new highs but it can have a 10 20 percent pump uh, this month or the ne next couple of months so that is a coin that i'll be keeping an eye out for if it pulls back to you know I'm not going to buy it here. If it pulls back to sort of this 700 zone, guys, I'll be looked to add. Or if I see nice price action, you can see the volume on here is killing. It's going down. If I see a nice volume spike, good price action, it can have a nice little rally. And it is a good project. There's some news coming out as well for this. Um, so this could be an interesting project. And again, guys, if you want to earn free XLM or Stellar Lumens, uh, Coinbase, again, now I don't really use referral links, but Coinbase is doing a free giveaway, guys. I'm going to add the link below if you're interested in getting some free Stellar Lumens, I think the first four people can get ten dollars. It's literally you've got to watch a few videos on Coinbase, and you can get that. I mean, I've done it I've, uh, again. I don't need. You know, I'm not saying I'm rich, but you know, it's forty dollars. It's still money, and and uh, I think there's a joke. If a millionaire sees hundred dollars or ten dollars on, on the floor, he'll pick it up. And you know, I'm not a millionaire by any means, guys. But I'm just saying, you know, free money. Um, 
so that's Stellar Lumens. The next two coins, I was going to talk about Litecoin uh, uh, a bit earlier, but I've sold my Litecoin just now. It hit my stop loss. Yeah, you can see it's broke down below. So I was hoping for Light. I was going to talk about Litecoin because I really liked that it was above here. And I was hoping that it can consolidate and break above, but then it broke down. I've talked about Litecoin. I think it hit my stop loss here, actually. Could be looking to buy this now, you know. I'm going to finish this video and I'll, I'll look to trade Litecoin because it's at a good zone that I like, actually. Yeah, it's not. It's not. Um, it's a decent zone. It has to perform here because if it goes below it, guys, then uh, my idea for Litecoin might not be correct. Again, Litecoin has been another really nice trade for me. I think I got in just above the moving averages. Yeah, I think I sold it here for 12% profit. It was a nice little trade for me, Litecoin. But yes, guys, I would want to talk about Litecoin because um, it's got the halving less than 14 days away, and I made a video again yesterday. And Litecoin has been my most profitable trade. And my thoughts are, you know, previously when we look at history. Watch my Litecoin prediction for uh, the, uh, the halving breakout. And I said, you know, previously Litecoin rallied hard going into the halving and then it crashed. And I think something similar might happen. And we've had the big rally. I don't think we'll see another rally like this. But we can have another decent rally to the previous highs or around that level if it can get above this. And that's what I'm kind of expecting to play. I sold my like when I made videos about it. Especially this 786 level zone was very strong. It couldn't get above it. And yeah, I was interested in Litecoin guys and if it can get above it, uh, then I'll be interested in buying some more. But you could look for a small time scalp trade that I'm going to do after this video. You could look that uh, that trade as well. That can have a nice little pump. But I think there's going to be some FOMO towards the halving. The late guys, the late people that haven't bought might think, oh, let me get some Litecoin. If if uh, if Bitcoin doesn't do something crazy, people might be interested and buy some Litecoin just to think, oh, the price is gonna go up when the halving happens. And I'm not, I'm sure people have messaged me on Facebook, Twitter, asking me, oh, shall we buy Litecoin for the halving pump? And you know, so people there are newbies that are gonna FOMO into it and who don't really know too much about charts. But I didn't really, really like the fact that it's broken that red level because it could be you know, in the head and shoulder pat head and shoulders pattern. So I'm not as interested in Litecoin as that. As it was, it was going to be one of the top, the first one I talk about. But since it, I, I saw that price action, like I said before I started this video, I think it just dumped recently. Yeah, it just dumped recently. So I'd, uh, I had my stop loss just below here and it hit that. Anyways, guys, I still think Litecoin might have a nice little rally before the pump. The last one is a bit of a wild one. I haven't really done my research. It's a wild card entry. It's Wink. And I've talked about Binance. I've talked about how much I like Binance. And they're actually a good player in the industry. I know they still have wash trading and some fake volumes. But overall, I do like them. And Wink, I don't talk too much about fundamentals, but Wink is the gaming platform. And gaming, I was talking to someone on Twitter who, who's into gaming and he knows about it. Um, and, and in Reddit as well, I talked to the guy. He's very knowledgeable in Reddit. I've, I've asked him to join our Facebook group. Um, he's a great guy on Reddit and he's a, he's a massive gamer and he knows how it works. And he said, you know, Wink is actually a good, good project. And I do, you know, I'm not just going to buy because he said so, but... I'm going to look to trade this coin hard guys, you know how Binance IEOs work, they, re they sell off hard but you get some really really good pumps, so we've done it with ERD in the group, we've traded one, one had a nice pump, um, ERD guys I think that was a really nice trade for me, uh, That I believe that's a Binance IEO as well and that you know when when nice two little breakouts, the first one was even better, this one was still, still quite good, uh, let's have a look at that breakout retest boom a nice 10 percent trade so yeah i'll be looking to trade this coin but it might have a sell-off like you know how binance ieos work but they're not a newcomer to the industry you know previous incarnation tron bet was the first d app launched on tron network and it's one of the leading gaming application in terms of active users and transaction volumes so and gaming guys is always always going to be here it's not going to die down so that's the project that i'm that i'm interested in so if you get if you get to win some you know you might be able to make some profits or if you're like me you'll probably be trading it so those are the top five coins guys i'm going to be doing this probably a couple of times a month and don't just watch it actually learn from it guys and and again 
the first one I talked about was Binance coin. I've made loads of videos about BNB. I've even called it the best coin in 2019. I'll say, I should say Bitcoin is my favorite. Then I've talked about REN or Republic protocol, guys. That's another coin that I kind of like fundamentally, but more about the price action. I've kept you guys up to date on Telegram, Facebook, Twitter. And again, guys, if you're not subscribed, guys, make sure you subscribe and turn on the notification button. I've got some great things coming up for this channel. Uh, again, all the content is free, guys. So I'd really appreciate if you li liked subscribe turn on the notification button so you don't miss out uh, some awesome content then i talked about xlm guys obviously there's this uh, link i'm going to leave below as well if you're interested um the cell lumens they've got the world world real world application and the price is really beaten up so it can have a nice pump and the last two coins i talked about litecoin i think it might have a nice little rally it won't be as crazy as before but i think it can have another rally before the halving because there's going to be some late FOMO people that are waiting on the sidelines last one I talked about wink guys I'm going to be quite interested in this in this coin as well I will talk to you guys about it and um, see what people are interested in and again I'm going to keep you guys up to date on wink so make sure you subscribe and turn on the notification button and like I said I'm on holiday this week so I won't be making as many videos and updates but when I'm back guys like I said I'll be starting an educational group so I wanted to have a nice little holiday before I get stuck in with you guys trading almost 24 7 24 7 7 days a week 3 6 5 the 3 for a whole year that I'm, I just love trading anyways guys thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel and guys comment below your favorite coin this month and which coin you think is going to break out thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much